Hello explorers, today we will be going over how to do your bullet journaling for the month of December. Starting with my reflections page, I usually write down what I'm expecting for the month of December. Going on to filling out the rest of December, I am just doing a short, compact monthly layout with all the days and the dates. Next up, we are going on to the full monthly layout of December, filling out those grid lines. And also, we're going to be filling out all the rows for this grid layout format. I will be taking my marker and start putting down all the highlights so I can put down the days and also the dates on them. On the side, I usually put a space for notes to write down any birthdays or special events happening. On the next page is my gratitude log, along with my habit tracker. I've been really using this uh, gratitude log and habit tracker pages because during the month of December, there is so much to keep track of, such as my water consumption, my workout time, and my self-care time. One of the popular sections that people have been messaging me about is the meal plan and the groceries list. Writing down exactly what you need for the upcoming weeks at the beginning of the month helps you not only save money, but it gives you an overlook of exactly what you need. Whenever you think you need a certain amount, you can actually cut that amount in half and that would be perfect. On the grocery side, I just write down the categories that I shop the most for, which is veggies, fruits, grains, and proteins. I also use this content page because I tend to basically do a layout of everything I'm going to be doing for that month. In the gift guide, which is I think is very necessary for the month of December, I'm writing down the name of the person along with the gift that I will be giving them. For my weekly layout, I do this very simple spaced out layout. That way I have plenty of space to write down exactly what I'm doing every single day and any uh, quick little birthdays or events uh, that I need to write down as a weekly overview.
I was given these stickers by my aunt. She is uh, obsessed with stickers, journaling, and everything in between. So why not? I will be decorating my December layout with this floral motif. Even though the holidays can seem like such a chaotic and hectic time, I really hope that you can find the space and energy to be able to just take a moment, relax, and enjoy what is happening around you. Even though it can be a bit loud when family comes over or when friends are all chatting away, the companionship and just the overall convivial time is something to be incredibly grateful for. I hope this December layout helps you stay a little bit more organized for this fun but chaotic month. Feel free to subscribe to my channel, also press the little bell button to be notified when a new video comes out. I encourage you to visit the website paralife.com, our Pinterest page, and our Instagram page where I will be posting the links to at the bottom. Goodbye explorers!